to walk in front of it if you want to film. What's that? So, my dear Holmes, what are we investigating today? I say, old bean, we've made it. Look, the house of the old lady. Oh, yeah. Who's the old lady? I don't know, but she's bloody well dead. Do we know any details on the case? Well, apparently a scream was heard at 12.50 in the afternoon. 12.50? Ah! ah, my God! Quick! Quick, Watson! Did you hear it? Hey, we checked it out, my dear. We gallivanted through the forest. This way! Home's like lightning! <laughs> It's a message, Watson! You see, I think what the killer's done is he's drawn his own face on this bush. Do you see? He's got big eyes, a nose, and a mouth. But he he's right on. once again, of course. So, what we're looking for is a man with a ruff. A man with a ruff that looks a little bit like. Possibly a time traveller from the 19th century. Time traveller? A time traveller, Watson. Where else could it be? Have a look, Watson. Look for a clue. We searched the area. Search for clues that could lead us to our killer. But without being able to see the body or inside the house, this became a very difficult quest. Watson! Yes, Holmes? An arrow! That must be it, sir! Japanese gardens. No wonder that man had squinty eyes. The killer's Japanese. Uh, indeed, so the Asians. At it again. The killer might be anywhere around here, so we've got to tread carefully. Oh, I'm again. What she does best is to run. Exactly. Oh, my battery. Really? Oh, oh my lord, Watson! Shoot her! Your gun? <laughs> I think I stunned her! Go, Holmes, go! <laughs> Come, Watson! You must be have stunned! It. Watson! This is the killer we're looking for! What did you do with the old lady? We'll take her in for further questioning. Good job! Another case solved by Watson and Holmes. <laughs>